how's it going? I hope you guys are all doing great. And if not, as always, I hope it gets better for you. So a real quick video for you guys today. I thought this was really cool and I wanted to share with you guys. You see up there, that is a Pirulina Vitata. It's a type of pencil fish. And he was actually up here laying in this cone. I'm pretty sure, I could be wrong. Could be a male, could be a female. Some of them tend to get the red on their fins. Opposed to these over here. So I guess, I guess they have it a little, but not as dominant as the others. But this is really cool. So they love this fish. But if you look at the top here, all these tiny little dots, they laid eggs on this deli cup. Now some of you guys may be asking why I have a deli cup lid in my tank. Actually, when I used to use air stones and uh, whatnot, sponge filters, I would stick these up on top of the airline to actually catch the bubbles to keep it from splattering all over the rim and all over the light and everywhere else. But yeah, I thought that was really cool. I have bred these out before. Um, they've been fairly easy to breed, but I didn't know. It's just kind of wild because that's a super, super shallow area to be laying eggs. Kind of different. Pretty neat though. Love these, this tank. Glossolepis maculosa, super rare killie. We got some C. alani in there as well. Some uh, Procatopus assimilis. There's one over there. I'll roll some B-roll for you guys too. From actually, stand is where they used to be but they actually have some babies in here as well I'm near the top of the water kind of hard to see because I got all that food in there there you can see kind of in the middle up at the top of the water little fry moving who knows what's down inside of it there's a lot of space rock piles plants these are all no filters See the sponge isn't running, still in there, but all no filter. Love it. Now I do have some babies as well of the Perilina Vitata pencil fish. These are from those parents. I actually got these from Regina Spotty of All Bottle Aquatics. That is uh, Eric Bodrock's wife or partner. But absolutely cool fish love them really peaceful great for communities if you want some i do have some on the site so check it out lbaquatics.com all right so i did end up putting the lid here in the fry rack i had to actually take the lid off because the eggs actually stuck to it i'll show you real quick i didn't think the uh, pirulina eggs were that sticky but things are really tiny really small so I just take that out and putting them up here where there's less light in case they are light sensitive but I don't think they would be if they laid them up top like that so who knows and um, yeah keep you guys updated all right looks like the male is already near the new cup all colored up Let's see what happens all right, so there you have it. A unusual way for the Pirulina Vitata pencil fish to actually breed. It was kind of a random thing in my fish room, so I wanted to share it with you guys because it's just out of the norm. And yeah, I thought it was cool. So if you like, hit that like button. If you did, subscribe, that would be awesome. And yeah, until next time, everybody, peace. Have a great one.